ये टू एन प्लस थ्री डिवाइडेड बाय यर अंडर रूट ऑफ एन स्क्वेयर प्लस टू एन सो दिस इज मैक्सिमम साइन ऑफ द एन दैट इज टू सो इफ यू टेक ए कॉमन एन स्क्वेयर फ्रॉम दिस टर्म दैट इज एन स्क्वेयर इफ एन स्क्वेयर दैट इज कॉमन देन रिमेनिंग वैल्यू दैट इज ओनली वन प्लस हियर टू एन बट वी रिक्वायर द कॉमन एन स्क्वेयर so we require to divide one n here so when this n square multiply with 2 divide by n the result that is 2 n so value or result that is same here again maximum power of n that is square so we require to common n square here and no any value so becomes 1 minus 3 by n square now next solution that is common out n square or outside the n square from under root so becomes here n and same way here becomes n so limit n tends to infinite 2n plus 3 as it is this n square from square root side becomes n n 1 plus 2 by n plus this n square from square root side that is n n 1 minus 3 by n now we want to simplify it this n and here this n we want to remove it so we take a common n so here limit n tends to infinite if we again common out n from our numerator side that is here n and here too plus no any n so we divide n so result become same and we want to take a common n from both the term so here 1 plus 2 by n plus here 1 minus 3 by n square now again we want to simplify this term here n n here n finally both are cancel out and again we want to simplify this term also so we apply the rule for limit the rule that is limit n tends to infinite 1 upon n then the result that is zero so if we apply the limit to this term so here 2 plus 3 by n so apply the limit over numerator then sign must be equal to so here too but limit n tends to infinite 3 by n that is 1 by n and the result that is 0 so here 2 plus 0 divide by the square root this one as it is because no any n that is divide by n plus sign as it is but here 2 by n that is nothing but ultimately 1 upon n form and the result that is 0 plus here 1 as it is minus sign as it is but 3 upon n square so limit n tends to infinite 3 upon n square infinite square that is again 0 1 upon infinite square now we simplify it here to divide by here square root of 1 plus 0 so here 1 plus here 1 minus 0 and square root the result that is also 1 equal to 2 1 plus 1 2 and this 2 and this 2 both are cancel out and the result that is 1 so we write it our answer our answer that is 1 
now we move to our next question next question that is limit n tends to infinite 3 n cube minus 5 n square plus 7 n minus 1 divide by 4 n cube plus n square minus n plus 1 so we write it sum that is limit n tends to infinite 3 n cube minus 5 n square plus 7 n minus 1 divided by 4 n cube plus n square minus n plus 1 so again this is n tends to infinite form and we can't put the limit at present so ultimately we want to convert our this term that is nothing but 1 upon n form that is limit n tends to infinite and 1 upon n type form and we can replace the limit that is directly 0 so here maximum power of n that is here n cube so we take a common n group n cube from our numerator side that is limit n tends to infinite n cube value that is common so remaining term that is here 3 this minus sign is it it second term here 5 n square so but we require to common n cube so we divide 1 n so when this sign multiply n cube multiply with 5 by n the result that is same that is 5 n square plus 7 but only 1 n here and we want to common n cube so we divide by n square so n cube divided by n square and the result that is same that is 7 n minus no any value of n so we divide with n cube divide by again same way here n cube value that is common out because maximum power that is here n cube so remaining term that is here 4 plus here n square but we require to take a common that is n cube so we divide 1 n so answer becomes same that is n square minus here only n so we divide with n square plus no any value of n so we divide with n cube now next step that is simplify this term here n cube and here n cube both are cancel out so finally this limit that is n tends to infinite apply with 3 n tends to infinite apply with 5 by n and the result that is 0 so we write it when applied the limit put the sign equal to these 3 as it is apply limit n tends to infinite to 5 by n that is 0 because of the rule plus 7 by n square again 1 upon n square infinite square 1 upon infinite square again result that is 0 minus 1 upon infinite cube again 0 because of rule divide by here 4 as it is plus 1 upon infinite again 0 minus 1 upon infinite square again 0 1 upon infinite cube again 0 so finally the result that is 3 by 4 so we write it our answer that is 3 by 4 now we move to our next question next question that is 4 n cube minus 7 n square plus 5 n minus 1 divided by 8 n cube minus 7 n square plus 3 n 
plus 1 so we write it first limit n tends to infinite 4 n cube minus 7 n square plus 5 n minus 1 divided by 8 n cube minus 7 n square plus 3 n plus 1 so again here we check maximum power of n square from numerator side that is n cube take a common n cube so limit n tends to infinite n cube that is common remaining term here only 4 same as our previous sum minus 7 and here n square and here n cube so we divide 1n plus 5n but we common n cube so we divide with n square minus 1 no any value of n so we divide with n cube divide by here maximum power of n that is n cube so again same we take a common that is n cube here remaining term that is only 8 minus here 7 n square but we take a common n cube so we divide 1 n here plus 3 here 1 n and here n cube so we require to divide 1 n square that is n cube multiply by 5 n 5 by n square the result are same plus 1 no any value of n so we divide with n cube now this n cube and this n cube both are cancel out and we applied the limit and the rule for limit applied that is when n tends to infinite 1 upon n the result that is 0 so using this rule limit n tends to infinite this 4 as it is it is all 0 here 0 here same as our previous sum 5 by n square because of rule that is 0 here 0 so only remaining term that is 4 divide by this 8 as it is sign equal to whenever place the limit 7 by n that is 1 upon infinite that is again 0 here 3 by n square when we apply the limit that is again 0 and 1 upon n cube that is again 0 so only remaining term that is 8 and here 4 so 4 by 8 that is 1 by 2 so 1 by 2 that is final answer and we write it our answer that is 1 by 2 now we move to our next question here limit n tends to infinite under root of n multiply with under root of n plus a minus under root of n <coughs> we write it first limit n tends to infinite under root of n under root of n plus a minus under root of n now the term we want to simplify that is use rationalization of this term so when we use rationalization then here limit n tends to infinite here under root of n here under root of n plus a this minus as it is now multiply n divide with his rationalization term that is multiply with under root of a plus a this minus becomes here plus under root of n and same value we want to divide that is under root n plus a plus under root of n 
why because of we want to remove this square root now just check here if we assume this term a here assume b here a minus b multiply with if we assume here a same as a here plus b so finally the result that is a minus b into a plus b a square minus b square so we simplify this term limit n tends to infinite this under root of n here a minus b and a plus b result that is a square so here under root of n plus a square minus b square b that is only under root n so under root n square divide by put this term as it is so that is under root of n plus a plus under root of n now we more simply have a numerator first so here square root and here square again here square root and here square so finally this square root and square are cancel out so limit n tends to infinite here under root of n as it is but here only remaining term that is n plus a minus sign as it is and here square root and here square so remaining term only n divide by replace this term as it is that is n under root of n plus a plus under root of n now we simplify our numerator first so here n plus n and here minus n so finally both are cancel out now simplify way we write it first that is limit n tends to infinite this under root of n as it is and here only value that is a